Okay, so we've got our slab. I'm going to place the cast iron on there. I've got my regular club hammer, okay? Now to try and keep this as uh, scientific as possible, I'm going to hold the club hammer at a certain height on me and drop it and we'll see what happens, okay? So, okay, at head height, I'll just bring this in close. You can see that a crack has formed in the cast iron, okay? Um, now let's do the same, this time with the plate steel. And um, to look at, uh, the, the plate steel looks like substantially thinner and uh, you might think weaker material. But let's see. Okay. Head height again. Okay. Okay, let's try and get a close up. All we've got so far is a bit of denting and scratching. That is the case. And that's part of the reason for the integrity and the strength behind the um, fireplaces that um, Charmwood make. Plate steel is extremely strong. Okay, just for fun, let's just see what we can do to finish these two off. So head height again. Okay. This time you can see the, the crack very clearly, okay? Um, and that is the nature of the casting. It's just the nature of the type of uh, metal it is. It has no give, um, so if it takes a knock, um, that's what happens, it will crack. But it has to take a big knock, especially the stuff that we get, we get from the factory in Britain. But let's just do one more whack onto our steel. See if we can do much more damage to that. So look, I've improved the dent, can you see? Uh, basically, it's got a slight curve to it now, but that's two pretty hefty wax. Let's just do one more. Again, you see, it's just bending now, okay? So that's the difference.